Hi, everyone. I just want to quickly show you uh, a very important function in Excel called this functions in Excel. Uh, what dix, dix means? Dix means uh, when you want to uh, use an Excel to return a discount rate uh, for any security investment that you have. Um, if you have any security investment and you want to return the uh, the distance rate, um, you can definitely use a Dix functions to do that. Uh, what does that mean is that uh, the 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 Dix himself uh, it will come in form of a percentage. Um, you have a security and you want to determine the the discount rate on that security. You use the Dix functions in Excel. And um, so it consists of uh, the syntax is always a uh, settlement. Uh, that's the, uh, the settlement date of that security, uh, the date that you're going to settle that security. Uh, settlement date is just a settlement date of that security. And we also have maturity is the date that the settlement date is just the date that you start paying. Uh, the disk is uh, the discount rate is start calculating and the maturity days is the date of when the uh, the security uh, is ready uh, uh, i mean the date of the security we are the PR. PR is just the the investment security price um, or any mortgage loans or any security bonds or anything that you obtain from the lenders uh, is the price that you've been given is the price and predominantly a lot of the price is always has to be something like a par I mean, like uh, sometimes you can say hundred thousand par or hundred pounds par per value by what i mean is by the face value uh, of the security um we also have redemption redemption just means uh, is the face values of that security that's the redemptions face value i mean when you have the security and how what is going to be the face values in future uh, so redemption is just definitely the face value so and we have the basic basic is, is we have the different type of basic as a default zero is a default and uh, what does that mean is that uh, uh, you have uh, a uh, basic that will come in from of what, 0, 1, 2, 3. So it depends on the regions that you are. So um, we, we're we going to use this. Let's assume that uh, we have a data type of this and we want to use a DIX to be able to determine the discount rate uh, for this investment security uh, when we have a price of that, which is 567,000. Uh, now around 70. Uh, so we want to determine the uh, the discount uh, that we can use for this. Uh, which let's um, assume that the uh, we have the settlement, the maturity, and the uh, redemptions. As long as all these are required, so they can able to use DIX to determine the disc uh, this country. So all you need just need to do is just go on Excel, just put the word DIX and open the parentheses and you can see that the settlement date and uh, the the settlement date is just this date uh, which is 12 uh 01 2020 2020 uh the maturity date is on the june 6 2026 uh where has the price uh, of the security uh, we have 568 1970 and we have the basic uh, the redemptions let's assume that the first back right here and you can see here uh, the basic can be uh, United States which is uh, 30 to stroke 360 uh, we also have the actuals you can use the actuals which is one the basic always start from zeros as a default and you can also use the actual it's just the numbers of years uh, days in a year so the actual is 360 and uh, we have the euro 30 uh, stroke 360 but let's assume that we just want to use the actual so actual so we'll just so you can see here we have negative uh, uh, amount 
so which 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 uh, this one let's convert this one to a percentage so this is the um the disc discount at the end of the security so you can see what we have here so this is how you can calculate um um the 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 dicks as well and also you can also use the ticks by just bringing the dates, uh, the settlement date using the date format. The maturity, you can also use the date format. Uh, so instead of using that, you can also do that. So that's another way of so how you can determine. Uh, so yeah, thank God. Uh, sorry, uh, that's good thing. Yeah, so yeah. Um, and now we see you in the next chapter. Thank you. Bye for now. Take care. Bye for now.